What's going on, Newborn Nation? It's your boy, Newborn Killick here, welcoming you back to Super Mario 64 Sapphire. Now, if you remember last time, we finished up actually two levels. We had done all of the ice level, and now we're about to do all of the water level, Lush Lagoon, hopefully. Again, we are back. This is a short Super Mario 64 mod. Not meant to be difficult by any means, which is nice, because I am not looking for anything super strenuous on the head right now. But we will see. Hopefully, this will live up to the hype. And so far, I would say it's very nice. It's got... Oh, well, I see that. I want that. Um, this looks horrible. Okay. Death sand. Death darkness. Running them. Oh. Ooh. Wow, this is incredible. This is uncharacteristically treacherous. Oh, god, I shouldn't have I double guessed myself. How could I? How could I indeed? I didn't mean to do that noise. That was a predominantly negative noise! Look, I know it really wants me to do this submerged switch, but I, I just, I, I just don't want to. I want to do this one. I want to do this. Okay, so we're gonna whip out the save states here. Oh, way overshot. Okay. All right, here we go. Here we go. Hup. Oh god, that's so dead. Ha! Ha! Maybe I'm missing something here. Ha! Well, nice uh nice on. Nice on indeed. All right, let's uh so let's try something else for just a smidge. Maybe we're not actually supposed to be doing that that way. What if- maybe we're supposed to bounce off of them? Oh, if we're supposed to bounce off, like, use the force- the f forward momentum- What is going on? Oh my. Anyway, as I was saying, like, maybe we're supposed to bounce between all of them, but that seems... Pretty intense, really. We're going for the submerged switch. I see the submerged switch. I know we have a cap for such things. So my think is, I guess it's not over there. Get out of here, shark. I don't need your sass in my life. I would probably be on the pirate ship. If I were the red cap. That's probably where I'd put it if I were a game designer. I guess I should be collecting the coins or something. What is in here? Coin box. Nice. At some point we are going to find that... Yeah, I'm like 80% sure this won't work. Okay, all right, we're gonna go back to this. I think maybe we're supposed to use our full momentum. Oh, oh, bo oh, wow, that was satisfying. Oh, that was satisfaction central. Oh, oh boy. Wow, it, <laughs> Goomba Tramplaning. Yeah, I, I suppose that probably would have given it away what I had to do, but that was a lot of fun. That was just f straight up fun. It's like, it's like this person who made this mod is like, oh, what are all the most satisfying things that I could possibly do uh, to a person? And then just throws them all out there. I'm, I'm thinking you could probably hit it like that. But maybe not. I don't, I don't actually know. I'm gonna try it one more time. Oh God, that was so satisfying. No, very close though. Okay, so probably supposed to find the metal caps somewhere. As to where that is, it's anyone's guess really. Guess I can pick up these coins just to kind of back up this time. Make sure that we're doing something. Got the coins, put it the easy mode. And while we're at it, I guess we may as well pick up the red coins as well. As it really doesn't make sense to do those separately. So, under the water we go then. I haven't actually been underwater in this mod yet. Not that that's, that's really not that strange, I guess. It is a very short mod. I do appreciate the fact that, um, ooh, okay, good. I tried to slow, <laughs> slow myself down with that grab and it it, it, it it was efficient and it worked. Very well. Oh great, we to go play with the shark now. My favorite. I want this coin. Okay, just don't nom me, shark. 
Oh, don't pay attention to me. Okay, so it doesn't seem as if he's putting red coins inside. It seems as if he's always pu only putting red coins inside bushes. And it seems like the creator of this mod is very... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Systematic? In these sorts of things? Like... He didn't put... Yeah, wait for that shark to go by. Okay, we're running in. We're going in. We're going in, boys. We're going in. Do not bite, shark. I do not taste well. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and kind of follow him so we don't just... I'm just thinking we don't... we just kind of have to stay out of his path. I don't actually know if he has any way to... actually eat us? I, I really don't know. But anyway, as I was saying, the creator of this mod seems to be very systematic with their placement of the red coins. It's something we discussed last episode, but in case you missed that, basically he finds a place to put one red coin and then he follows up... well, they follow up on that p style of positioning through all of the coins. So, realistically, very appreciated. Like, in last in the last level, they were all in a box somewhere in the level. So, like, you still had to find the box, but once you found a box, you're like, oh, there's probably a red coin in there. In the first level, they were all in... Uh, they were all on top of little poles, so you could always find them. If you found the pole, you'd know you were going to find yourself a red coin. And that's something I very much so appreciate. I think that red coins are a staple of Mario and they shouldn't go anywhere. But at the same time, especially when recording, they're just not that entertaining to get. I mean, when you're like when I'm on my own, I do think red coins, you know, like they're okay, they're fine. But eh. It's just a lot of looking around and searching, you know? Not a lot of action. I'm all about that action. Of course, maybe it's not even that big of a deal to be searching for these red coins anyway, so... Who knows? Let me know! Are are you all fans of the red coin format? Etc, etc? Or would you rather them just be <laughs> big on thought? Anywho, it's what. About to get our last three coins here, hopefully. I'm glad I didn't miss any of these, or I would have been in a bad time. Got him! Alright, one star completed. About to have two Tudo. I was on the pirate ship. I don't know. Uh, I don't know how to get to the pirate ship. I bet I can make this. I don't know why I'm quick saving. I'm not going to use it. Oh, actually, I might just be able to board the ship in general. Hello. I can. Nice. I would like on, please. And we're ready to head right back in. We are just killing this game. I mean, I know <laughs> it's kind of I think it's supposed to be kind of that way. Goomba, okay, so we got Goomba trampolining. I was I was hoping I could see that third star so we could kind of tell exactly what was going on. But as I forget, that is not a thing we can do. So we're going to go back to this pirate ship. There was a block on here that I didn't get a chance to explore. I, I, I mean, I have a couple of options or thoughts as to what we might be able to do with this cannon here. We might be able to shoot onto the switch, maybe? Nice. Adjust myself backwards. No! Oh, I just wanted it. Okay, we're not that far back. I'm trying... Some, some of the jumps are slightly tricky. Oh, god damn it. I, I mean, I'm also just kind of bad. Yay! But if I, you know, if I knew the game a bit better, no! I don't know what just happened there! That was weird! Like, so that kind of seems like maybe it's not a triple jump. It's not triple jump material. Just double jump material. I'm gonna quick save up here. That's why we quick saved up there. <laughs> because I'm getting tired of doing this damn jump. Oh, okay. So that that was the correct option. Hello! Hi! I'll prepare the cannon for you. Sick cannon prepare. Ready for blast off? Come on, hop in the cannon. Okay. I tried to make that as stylish as possible. Unfortunately, it can only be so stylish. Uh, hmm, gee, I wonder what we're supposed to do with this dang cannon. Hmm, I wonder if maybe we're not supposed to shoot up there into the dark abyss of nothingness! I mean... The consequences for failure are pretty low, so that's cool. 
Pa, 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 pa. Mm. Mm. Status fire. Okay. We should be about to clear up this level here. And then we'll be able to move on to the last, last level. Because I still have yet to figure out what in the world to do with this switch. I have no idea. Yes, it definitely is submerged. But I haven't seen anything that's like, wait a minute. What's going on up there? Huh, I wonder if I could just shoot up there with the cannon. I mean, y okay, you know I'm gonna try. I have to try. I'm kind of hoping it doesn't work, because it does seem like there's some fun to be had up there. Whatever is up there. Oh wait, it doesn't even- doesn't even go that way! Oh. Uh, okay. Ah, uh, play with that block! Nice. I'm sure that felt great, Mario. I have yet to find- I'm going to go ahead and quick save here. I'm more so using these quick saves so that in case I, uh, in case I accidentally hit the, the button, then I don't, uh, Ooh. So that in case I hit the quick load button, I don't just yoink myself. Oh no. Whoop. We take those, boys. We take those. We have one more. I'm not... It's got a Donkey Kong. Okay. Okay. Well done. Oh. Well, this is a bit of a predicament we seem to find ourselves in now, isn't it? Huh. Anywho's it's what. Let's get on in here. That damn switch. Maybe... Wait, what is that? Hold on. Ah, yes. That. However we are to get there. Right, like, there's a possibility that it could be... No, there's... That's not a jump you can make. Go! I do have one other area we can kind of head to. Just to, just to, you know, kind of move forward. Maybe there will be some information there, but... There are these coins here. And methinks they might... Oh, well. That's really not where you want to be. I'm not really sure that the shark is doing anything to harm me. Or if he's just kind of like... Hey man, what's up? I'm a shark. How are you? Are you a shark too? No, you're not a shark? Um, why don't you go play with the god dang shark? Yeah, I thought- I thought so. That I thought that you might. I will, however, not be going over there while the shark is over there. Um, because that just seems like a bad move. Oh! No. My satisfaction. Okay. Easy mode! So with the exception of that one star so far, it seems as everything has been either quite simple or very satisfying. I'd really like to finish up this level on this episode. Please leap across the lumber. That's the one we got. I think I may have figured it out, question mark. It's kind of wishful thinking to think that I would think about doing this, but... No, oh, God. No! Oh, I made it! Quick save. Okay, that's how you do it. Metal cap, give me my star, fool. At least that music's still... Uh, still bumping, though. Nice. Come on, let's go. Oh, uh, come on, uh, just stop it, let me go! Oh my god. Oh, I'm not gonna mess it up here, am I? I feel ashamed for my actions, okay? Easy jumps, easy jumps, easy jumps, let's go, okay. Okay, okay. We've done it. 
Any who's it's what I believe that is the end of this level. Let me go ahead and jump back in, double check that the in, the getting in frame for this level is very small. Anyway, yes, that is the end of the Lush Lagoon. Thank you so much for watching all the way to the end. It helps me out an awful lot. I greatly appreciate it. I hope you are enjoying the series as much as I am. That one over there was a bit of a doozy, but otherwise it has been an amazing ride. Just satisfaction and happiness all the time. Anyway, thank you so much for watching all the way to the end again. I'm Newborn Keelik, and I will see you in the next one. I'm out.